What we have here is a black and brass 36 inch Hunter original. And this one has the adapter irons. Now, you're probably thinking, wait, these don't look like adapter. Where's the hub? Well, the 36 inch adapter is a bit different. They did not have a single integrated, a single unit hub. Now what these do are far simple, far more simple. You just, you just turn it and it clicks into place. Each blade turns by hand, it's similar to reverse air, but unlike reverse air, these irons are actually relatively light and yeah, they don't drag the fan. They don't. They don't cause. I don't add it. Yeah, they don't add extra drag. Here's the tag. The fan dates to December of 1981. Now. Back in this era, back in the R&M era, motors and blades were sold separately. Now, Hunter switched from adapt air to reverse air in uh, 1980, I believe. Maybe 81. So, chances are there was a set of old adapt air blades because the irons were also sold with the blades themselves. So they ended up buying a set of adapt air irons and blades for this van, which is kind of neat. And it's black and brass, which in and of itself isn't the most common finish. It's more, it's less common than brown and brass, which is equally cool. Anyway, let's see how it performs. Starting on low, it has an arcless pull chain. Which I find it be pretty cool. It has a little bit of wobble. Not too much. with the three arm light kit which chances are is period correct even down to the swirl glass Let's go to high. Has a bit of a startup wine and a running wine as well because it has the adapt air irons, which are about as light as the normal irons, it flies on high. Unlike the reverse irons, which because of the weight of the irons, adds extra drag to the motor and reduces the overall speed. Which kind of sucks. Therefore, I'm not a fan of the smaller reverse airs. But these are cool. Should do about 350 on high. Maybe 340-ish RPM.
haven't added oil to it, so it's running off the residual oil that was in the oil cup upon dis or deinstallation. So obviously, the spin down time's not going to be as long as it ordinarily would be. So, now we're going to reverse it, as you can see. Just twist. Twist, clickety, clackety, and now your fan has been reversed. And just like the reverse airs, the reverse pitch is slightly steeper than the downdraft pitch. How does that affect performance? Let's find out. Sorry, I don't know. It's definitely a little slower than it ordinarily would be. Got a high. Not as fast, but still effective. Now we let it coast again. And there you have it, a black and brass 36-inch adapter original.